Hi everyone, welcome back to uh, the Ethis Solo Bullshit, <laughs> as Sly bullshit. keeps calling it. Um, and it's not actually solo, we got Viv here again in our, our hempen camis. Is it a camis or a camise? What, what, what is that? Camis. Uh, yeah, what is, what is a camis? Educate it's me. Like a, it's like a blouse. It's like a blouse. A blouse. Yeah. Well, is it like a blouse or is it a blouse? I think it's a type of blouse. Right. So it's a category of blouse. So what, what's what's the difference then between a blouse and a chemise? I don't know. I can't tell you. You don't know? Nope. Aren't you supposed to know about like clothes and stuff? Is that sexist? Um, a little bit. <laughs> a little bit? <laughs> I don't, I don't wow. know. I feel... I feel inadequate as a woman now, yeah. so yeah. thanks for that. Well, believe it or not, I actually, um, I dress myself. Yeah. Wow. I do, yeah. I Didn't dress expect myself. that. Yeah, sometimes Poe dresses me. Uh, dresses Does he me. help with the buttons? Yeah, he, he makes sure that there aren't too many of them, and he makes sure that there's not too little uh, poop on my back. Oh. Which is really good of him. It's just really excellent. Yeah, you have to go out with just a little bit. Yeah, I mean, you have to, otherwise, you know, no one's gonna know that he's, that you're his bitch, right? And also, there has to be one hole in your shirt somewhere. Yeah, 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 yeah just one. Oh Are man. Are you gonna kill this guy? Yeah, I think I'm gonna fucking kill this guy. Why wouldn't I? I mean, I I always kill everyone. You know, that's why they call me. You know, one take at this. <laughs> I always kill everyone all the time. Wait, I, I, I was hitting the wrong thing. I was hitting the head. I should have been hitting something else. I don't know so how I missed why that. You, it, you might not kill him. No, I'll kill him. I, I just, I really thought it was the head. Oh. I mean, like, he doesn't do shit, does he? Nah. Well, look at him. All right, I got what it. What can he do? Well, I mean... He's just like sand. Smooth sand. Can we can we talk about for a minute the fact that he's a he's a lizard man? He's a lizard person. Okay. And um, this is Belladion. Uh, and as far as we know, the Belladions were uh, were Lullafels, right? Right. And we know that the lower parts were Marchi, who were also Lullafellian, as far as we know. So what right. the, what the fuck's going on? Why is he a lizard person? He's made of rocks. Maybe they just designed you... a rock lizard man. They just designed a rock lizard man. Okay. Because why did you open that? I don't want that stuff. Well, I just passed on it, so maybe you can pass on it. It's just a compulsion, all right? Um, well, I, I just fucking... I don't know. Like, this thing here, this is probably Marchi, right? Because it's, like, purple and shit. Yeah, it looks like a like a cool battery. Right. Does it have anything on it? See if it's got any markings on it. Nah, not really. Nah, it doesn't. Um, yeah, so maybe the, the Belladines were actually controlled by, like, uh, space lizards. You know, like America's controlled by space lizards. Right? We're definitely controlled by space lizards. Yeah, yeah. Haven't you seen all those, like, conspiracy theories, like, photoshopping politician's eyes to look like lizard eyes and they're like look you pause it for one frame right here he, he fucking lets his guard down you can see the space lizard eyes you know I what got i mean my eyes lasered into lizard eyes yeah totally yeah um you know what i'm talking about don't you i do i've seen it yeah it's hilarious it's really good my uh ex-girlfriend's mother was the uh the the, the president, the treasurer, and one of half a dozen of the only members of the New South Wales uh, UFO Society. Whoa. And uh, I'd be getting ear bashed about space lizards all the fucking time. All That's the time. Intense. All the time. And she'd be taking like paranoid schizophrenics into her home and like um, basically giving them uh, her sort of 
Well, 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 I mean, she called it therapy, but what she would do is she'd like enable their, their, their sort of paranoid fantasies about being abducted by government agents and stuff like that. Um, and they'd walk away being like even more convinced that that shit had actually happened to them. That's pretty terrible. Yeah, it's pr pretty fucking awful. I wasn't, um, I wasn't the biggest fan of her. Um, what did she gain from that? Did they give her money? No, no, no. It's just one of those like, um, you know, you just feel important, right? Ah, that's weird. You know, you feel important, you feel special, uh, you, you feel like there's, there's sort of people watching you because you're like important and dangerous, and uh, it makes you feel good. So, I don't know. Maybe, maybe there's people watching that, that kind of believe in uh, some of that Space stuff. Wizard. Well, I mean, I feel like there's a bit of a stretch between saying like, okay, you know, we're probably not alone in the universe and, you know, maybe there's been some kind of contact at some point to being like, the government's controlled by space lizards. I feel like, I feel like there's, there's a bit there's of... There's a middle ground. Yeah, I feel like there's a leap there somewhere. And um, I personally do not uh, particularly believe that we've had any kind of extraterrestrial contact that has had any significant... I mean, because cause people say things like, all right, so like the iPhone, right? must have been designed by by aliens because there's no way we could have done anything like that or you know the pyramids of ancient egypt were, were built by aliens because there's no way like humans could do something like that and i'm like you're just kind of shitting all over like humanity's greatest achievements you know it's like flight like space flight and stuff like that or oh, we couldn't have done that by ourselves and it's like i just feel like that's really cynical you know what i mean yeah, I don't like it when people say things like that. Yeah, so I start from the position where I'm sort of opposed to the idea of, you know, aliens intervening in human history. But at the same time, if people are of the position that like, yeah, they may be out there and we may have had some contact with them, I'm not like insulted by that idea. But I am, I do feel a little bit sort of perturbed when people start saying shit like, you know, all of all of humanity's greatest achievements we're not responsible for or uh, you know all of our our history and politics are being manipulated by by lizard people that really gives me the shit <laughs> how the fuck did we all oh, right because the yeah because the belladines the, the, yeah the belladines are controlled by, by space, space lizards. lizards yeah yeah okay all right well i think we got some pretty compelling evidence for that right here i don't know what you think but uh, that's what I'm all about. Um, it's. I think you could do better. You think I could do better? Yeah, I think you could do a little better. Do better than what? What do you mean? Uh, do better than Belladines to space lizards. Oh, where the fuck <laughs> is she? Where, I'm I'm trying to trying to fucking target her. <laughs> oh my god, they're actually doing a bit of damage. All right, well. She's almost dead. Yeah, I know she's almost dead, but, you know, they're doing a bit of damage. Alright, fuck him. YOLO. Um, you think we could do better? You think there's there's better theories than that? Yes. Okay, alright. Um, are you... Do you believe that the, uh... That the Marchi had, uh, heroes among them? Um... You know, I don't think so. I think they were a, a lot of smalls. A lot yeah. of small people trying to achieve one big thing. Yeah, well... That's the thing, is that we, we're told, right, that there were these migratory waves of Hure uh, near the beginning of the, the Sixth Astral Era, right? And that the, the, uh, the Belladians uh, sort of fought off uh, a, a couple of, you know, Hure incursions into into Thanalan, and that no one had really seen Hure before. Obviously, you know, the Allegans are some sort of distant cousin of the Hure or whatever, but I think it's safe to say they hadn't been around for a little while. And yet, all of the statues, <clears throat> excuse me, all of the Machi statues are like Hure-sized people. All the Belladine statues, again, all their statues of like Azema and stuff are all like Hure-sized and Hure proportioned. And uh, most recently, we've got like the undead um, uh, Marchi and uh, and white mages in Andapur City hard mode are hero models. So it's like I don't know. I I I I feel personally like there's some sort of miscommunication 
between, and I mean, look at these Belladine knights, right? Yeah. Another example, all of the Belladine undead are not Lalafellian proportion, right? So what the yeah. fuck's going on with that? And even in, uh, what is it? Even in the, where? The, the new Amdapur. Uh, yeah, the, yeah, that's what the I mean. Mages, the Miachi Mages. Yeah, the Miachi Mages. Black Mages, but they're, yeah. they're here. Um, so no what's idea. what's up yeah, with that? Why? Because I feel like it's a case hmm. of, all right, we don't want to be fighting like a bunch of Lalafellian size enemies because that's a fucking pain in the ass for like your positionals and, and you know, keeping... <laughs> that would be hilarious though, just to mow them all down. Um, but you know what I mean? I can't help but feel like there's some sort of miscommunication between the lore team and the people who are actually designing the dungeons. And that, um, they've kind of done this before where they've given us like this post hoc I guess like retconned reason for um, the statue of Shiva in uh, in the Churning Mists. That's a hero as well. And Koji, when he was asked about that, he was like, "Oh yeah, the uh, the dude who who made the statue was here, and and he just sort of you know he did like the white Jesus sort of thing, right?" Mm -hmm. But you can't really use that excuse here, can you? So, I mean, all I can say about these dudes, you look closely at these dudes, right, and there's like, there's not actually skeletons in them. Um, and it's the same with the, uh, the Machi corpses and the, uh, the White Mage corpses, the Amdapori corpses in, uh, in Amdapore City. They, they don't actually have, like, bodies inside them. So, you could be like, oh, it's just, you know, gear that's been, like, reanimated or whatever. Or maybe they're actually, like, I don't know, maybe they were always undead. Maybe what we're fighting here are, like, um, the, the Hure invaders that the Belladines killed and were like, you know what, fuck these guys are going to make them undead. And that was, like, the origins of the, uh, you know, the traitor Spurn, which, the, uh, which was what destroyed the sealed deers and turned them all into zombies, right? Yeah. Or maybe there's something like about being a Zambo is that like whatever shape you were, you just end up becoming a hero shape. Mm, and maybe I don't like that. and maybe heroes were like originally Zambos that like mated with elves. <laughs> uh, Ooh, how about that? I mean, you know, some people that. some people will be into that. I mean, it wasn't going to be the Duskwites that did that, obviously. No. Although that said, it pro oh. probably was totally the dust quite. Probably was the dust quite. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, no. Please don't say that. Uh, oh my god. I mean, people, people have been noting, like, I take offense whenever we see dust quites as, like, bad guys, as, like, petty thieves or, like, um, bandits or whatever. But I just, like, totally accept the fact that all lava fellas are scumbags. And people have been saying, like, I kind of just need to accept that, you know, the game sort of has a really kind of one-sided uh, depiction of, of the Lalafells, so that's just how they are, and maybe Duskwhite's the same, maybe we are actually just scumbags. <laughs> but um, I feel like there's a reason for it, you know? I feel like, I feel like we've got a good reason. Like, the Lalafells, I mean, no one's really hurt them, right? They've always been on top, right? Whereas with us, we, we got screwed <laughs> well, by the elementals. I wouldn't say that exactly. You wouldn't say that I've always been on top. <laughs> Short jokes. <laughs> um, you know what I mean though, like they've never had a particularly yeah, hard time. Yeah. Whereas the Duskwites have been screwed by the elementals and we've been screwed by basically everyone else ever since. And I feel like we've got like a, a perfectly good reason for being, uh, you know, salty. I'm just tired of everybody trying to pass off Lollapels as cute. They're not cute. Yeah, or as people. Yeah, that too. You're yeah. not cute and you're they're not, not people. They're not cute at all. Now oh, people are going to be like, Oh, Ethos, you? why aren't you using your defensive cooldowns? Mm. Alright, I'm using my fucking Use defensive cooldowns, alright? Life all right? Surge. Life Surge will be off cooldown in, in just a few seconds. I'm that guy at a show that screams songs, but it's Life Surge. For you. All right. Well, look, he's he's spamming that thing at the moment, which means he's not auto attacking me. Um, so we're still in the game, although he's about to do his his goop oh. thing. Don't do your goop. Oh, Get your goop away from me. I want your goop. Fuck me. He gooped me. Don't run into the zambos. Well, I didn't. I was. 
I wasn't getting hit ran, by the Zambos, right? right into the Zamboni. I was not getting hit by the... Fuck me. Alright. Well, this is one I've totally got this, dude. I just need to be using my defensive cooldowns a little bit earlier. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, you're fine. Uh, Ew, you sound gross. Uh, I feel gross. I'm really sick. You sound pretty sick. Now, what do you think this guy's deal is? Huh. I mean, did the Belladines build him? Yeah. You I think, think so? A little, I think there's a little Lala in there piloting him. That would be pretty cool. Um, because he's got the same model as those, um, uh, the Shapti, right? Oh. The elegant Shapti. You know what I'm talking about? Yummy. Yeah, I mean? yeah. Yeah, you're right. I never noticed that. So I can't help but feel like, um, you know, people are like, oh, you know, they're just reskinning other assets and stuff like that. What if this is actually like a, a reskin Shapti? You know what I mean? What yeah, if this is actually like an Allegan relic that um, that they uncovered? Because there, I mean, the, we got the Royal Allegan uh, uh, Sunway and whatever the other one is in Thanalan. Um, yeah. They they would have been, you know, a bit of that still around when the when the Belladines were creeping up. So maybe this is actually a case of, holy crap, I'm taking a lot of damage, of, um, of them finding, you know, an old, like, Allegan weapon and being like, oh, yeah, sweet, we're gonna, like, put some cool fucking armor on it, and, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's a total possibility. I can't help but feel like, in, in the same way that, um, you know, the, the Sargans almost definitely, uh, looked at the, um, uh, at the giant sea serpents and thought, oh, that thing's cool, mm. that's a god, that's that's gonna be our leviathan or whatever. Yeah. I feel like maybe something similar is going on here. They just stumbled upon this guy. Yeah, and they're like, like Fuck, let's give him some cool stuff. They're like, yeah, that's fucking sweet. He can fight for us. Fuck you! Why won't he let me... Mmm, shit. Shit on it! Oh my god! Shit on my dick! You vice gerent pizza! I'm he's not doing that. He's about to do me, isn't he? Yeah. Come on! All right, what do I do to get away from that? I think I need to stun him and then backflip immediately. Uh. All right, whatever. I'll get him. All right, this is what is this take three? No, because you're one take out. Yeah, this I mean, I mean, hi everyone, welcome back to the first take of our battle against the vice here into the warden. Uh, we're gonna do this in one shot because it's easy and because I'm great and because we've one shot everything in every dungeon so far, especially Oranos. And that's the truth. That is the truth. Come on, you pizza. Alright, well, I got my defensive cooldowns up nice and early. And I'm not gonna stun him a second time until I have to to get away from his bullshit. Zambo's behind you. Actually, he's he's doing a lot of physical damage, so um King is real fucking nice here. He's actually doling out a fair bit of punishment, if you believe that. Like, that that just hit for 1800. Behind you? Yeah, I see it. Yes! Perfect. That was perfect. I know. Alright, fuck you. Oh, no. No, 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 no. 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 <laughs> <laughs> so the the powerball draws in half an hour do you think i'm going to win 400 million dollars holy shit the powerball you 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 subscribe to that whole thing i, uh, I bought a few thingies today right you know why not 
I mean, yeah. <laughs> Every once in a while. Yeah, can happen. Yeah. Four hundred million. Jesus, dude, wasn't wasn't there just recently like some ridiculous record-breaking one of like several billion? Yeah, I think it got up to one point two billion. Jeez. But I think it ended up being split, didn't it? Uh, yeah, I believe so. But still. <laughs> like, oh, whoops, I got a few hundred million, how terrible. Did you hear about it? I think it was that, that big one, that 1.2 billion or whatever. Did you hear how, um, uh, Mr. Happy's old man thought he won it? I, I saw that. I saw that, that on Twitter. That was tragic. You see, he thought it was so funny and everyone else thought it was so funny and I'm like, I, if I was that old man, like, I would have a very hard time not killing myself that day. <laughs> yeah, that, that's a little rough. Man, that, I can't, yeah, I can't imagine many, many worse feelings going from, you know, like, 100 to 0 like that. Holy shit. That's crazy. Yeah. I okay, don't know. That's it's a big Zambo. Now I'm fucking trying, all right, and we just established these. He's probably not a Zambo. He's probably a, a Allegan dude or do that. It's an Allegan Zambo. All I right. just like to say the word Zambo. Yeah, I know. It's such a fun. Wait, what's what's another word for zombie? There's so many like fun words for zombies, but I I heard that one of them is actually like a racial slur. I know oh, I don't mean a wow. racial slur against zombies. I mean like a racial slur against, against people, like, a, like an actual Someone. people. Someone. Yeah. Um, we shouldn't say that one. But I'm trying to remember which one it was. <laughs> what? So, um, yeah, well, you'll have to say it to tell me, so I uh, we know not to say what it. What is it? What is it? Oh my god, he fucking hit me there? Are you kidding me? Where no did he way. touch you? Oh, he touched me on the butt. It was like right on the butt. Oh no. Oh no, please. Please no. Alright, here we go. There's the stunt. There's the flip. Nice. There's the second wind. You come to me, you pizza. Uh, I can do this. This is pretty stylish. Oh, what the fuck? Now he's... Now he's... I stunned too early. I stunned too early, he decided to do it to me right there. What a de hair. Oh, fuck me. That was going so well. Yeah, because I stunned there like as soon as he did the mark on me, which he does before he does the, the beam. But he did the beam anyway, once the stun was done. Speaking of things that are fun to say, are you excited for the, the Aquapolis? Aquapolis. The Aquapolis. The Aquapolis. You gonna come on? Um, I guess I'll do like two maps. See what it's all about. Well, it's only a one in five chance of it showing up. Oh, I guess I'll do it until it shows up, and I'll see how cool it is. Um, yeah, it looks cool. It looks fun. It's it's uh it's not going to be. I mean, it's just <laughs> gonna be the same mobs in like a different yeah. space <laughs> you know what i mean like it's just gonna be the same thing as um as uh as normal like treasure hunting i think i want there to be cool treasure yeah like, i mean really there's gonna be cool, cool treasure. treasure like there's gonna be like new mats and stuff like that but in terms of like the mobs and stuff like that i mean they could make it a bit more like hunt marks maybe make it like the s rank hunt, hunt marks where there's like some almost uh, almost mechanics, you know what I mean? But I don't know if well, I expect yeah. them to do that. I don't I know. Think, I think there will be. I'm kind of hoping that maybe there are like some little puzzles in there. Puzzles? It kind of looked like there would be no. some puzzles. Like someone touched a thing and something moved. I don't no. know. No. No, no puzzles. No, I don't think so. That would be crazy. Yeah. And that that would be like when when Yoshida was like, yeah, we're gonna bring in some jumping puzzles, and then they did that that thing in the gold torso, which we did like do once. Do you know how scared I was to get an ugly dog staff? <laughs> Tell me about it. How scared were you to get an ugly dog staff? I was so I was terrified. 
See, I was really hoping that it was going to be the uh, the first Eddie Glamour. I reckon that would have been amazing. That would have been fine. That would have been fucking awesome. Oh my god, why is he doing so much damage to me this time? Like, he didn't get a couple of crits off, I don't think. My food didn't wear off. You fucking pizza. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, you're fucked. No, you're fucked. No, I'm safe. No, you're fucked. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck. Ooh! Oh, you got him. Yeah, buddy. Oh, no tears. Good you job. see that? No tears. Win a whole episode with no tears. Look, there's a lava fell that was inside. <laughs> there he is. There he is. You fucking... You little... I can't target him. I want to slap him, but I can't target yeah, him. Yeah, me too. Oh, I want to slap, but I can't freedom. slap. Oh, thanks, everyone, for watching. The uh, Vice Gerent... Is it Vice Gerent? Vice Gerent? Vice... I don't... I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm terrible at pronouncing things. Yeah? Okay, all right. Yeah. Well, I'm sure someone will correct me if I was saying it wrong. Uh, anyway, he almost won a t-shirt, but he didn't. He didn't win a t-shirt. And... Uh, and I feel like, I don't know how I managed to get away with that. He missed, he missed like four times in a row in that last one. Oh, he needed more accuracy. He <laughs> needed some melds. Yeah, yeah, he needed some melds. So he's going to get some melds and then we'll, we'll do some kind of rematch. Um, but thanks everyone for watching and uh, we'll see you next time for some solo bullshit. Bye 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 Viv, you're not even facing the camera. Oh, my oh God. what the fuck? You don't even tell me which way to face. Oh, You're terrible. No, it's fine. You fa you you no. All right. Bye. Bye.